हेलो स्टूडेंट्स एस वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस अबाउट अ कोलाइडल सोल्यूशन नाउ लेट अस डिस्कस इट्स प्रिपरेशन फर्स्ट द प्रिपरेशन ऑफ लाइफिलिक कोलाइड्स लाइफिलिक कोलाइड्स इन दिस there is a greater affinity between the dispersed phase and the dispersion medium as we have already discussed because of this reason only these collides can be easily prepared by mixing the dispersed phase with the with the dispersion medium example we have already uh, done this preparation in the laboratory if you remember we have done the preparation of starch soap so we have just uh, made a star paste of starch and we have mixed in the boiling water so that means it is easy to prepare the solution that is a colloidal solution that is particularly lyophilic colloids preparation of lyophobic colloids as we have discussed that uh, there is no affinity between the particles of dispersed phase and the dispersion medium in the case of lyophilic phobic collides therefore some special methods are required in order to prepare it these methods are chemical methods briggs arc method peptidization method let us discuss each in detail the first is called as a chemical method which we are going to discuss here the colloidal solution can be prepared by chemical method lead to the formation of molecules which aggregate to form salts so it is chemically prepared method and therefore let us discuss each examples which is shown here the first example actually it is a double decomposition reaction this one here the sulfide sol of arsenic can be prepared by passing h2s by passing h2s gas through a dilute solution of arsenic oxide at the time and this is taking place in water so we'll be getting a arsenic sulfide sol so it is a chemical reaction and de double decomposition reaction is taking place let us discuss the second equation second equation it is an oxidation reaction this one oxidation reaction a colloidal sol of sulfur can be prepared by bubbling h2s gas through a solution of a bromine water or we can say sulfur oxide so we'll be getting the sol of sulfur so this is an oxidation method next reaction the next reaction is a reduction in which the colloidal salts of metals like gold can be obtained by the reduction of their compound like here we have taken the compound of this metal and we are doing the reduction so we are getting the sol of that metal so usually the metal sols are prepared by this method by this reaction next is the fourth one the fourth one is actually hydrolysis is taking place here a colloidal solution of ferric hydroxide is prepared when a concentrated solution of ferric chloride is added drop by drop in hot water that is in water when we hot water when we add this drop by drop we'll get uh, the sol that is ferric hydroxide sol so these are the some chemical methods by which uh, we can prepare uh, the lyophilic collides sorry lyophobic collides second method is briggs arc method this is a, a method which is used for preparing usually the salts of metals like gold silver copper 
etc. As it is shown in the figure, here the metal whose soul is to be prepared. This is the metal that is taken as electrodes. For example, if you want to prepare the soul of gold, we need to take the two electrode as gold or silver, whatever, which one we want to prepare. And these metals, the electrodes are placed or we can say immersed in a dispersion medium. This is the dispersion medium which is highlighted here. And the electric arc is provided. You can see the wires are there. Electric arc is provided. And this dispersion medium is kept cooled by surrounding it with a freezing material like ice. So the dispersion medium, you can see this dispersion medium, it is in a beaker which is kept in a container full of ice in order to keep it surrounding cool. Now, when we provide an electric arc, the tremendous heat is generated. In this tremendous heat is generated by which the metals start to vaporize. And when it vaporizes, it get condensed immediately in the liquid and it gives a colloidal solution. So this is called as Brexart method and by this method we will be getting the soul of metals. Peptization method. Peptization method, it is a method in which there is, we will add an electrolyte into a freshly prepared precipitate. You can see the electrolyte is added into freshly prepared precipitate. So at the time, the precipitate adsorb ions of electrolyte. You can see these are the, the bigger sized one is shown as the precipitate. And these are the ions of electrolyte. So the ions of the electrolyte, it start to adsorb, it get to adsorb on the surface of precipitate. As it is shown in this figure, now the precipitate is surrounded by the ions. Now a particular ion will get surrounded, so it will be develop a same charge. You can see here the positive charge is developed on this, positive charge is developed on this. So because, um, and because of this, uh, they, um, the, they start to ripple and uh, it will break up into small particles. We can say colloidal dimension particles. And because of this reason, we can say that the colloidal solution is prepared. So this method is, uh, is we can say, opposite method of coagulation. In coagulation, Colloidal solution is converted into precipitate, but in this precipitate is converted into colloidal solution. So what is this method called peptization? The process of converting a freshly prepared precipitate into colloidal form by the addition of suitable electrolyte is called peptization. The electrolyte used for this purpose is called peptizing agent. So let us summarize this topic that is preparation of collides. In this we have discussed that the lyophilic can be easily prepared by just mixing the dispersed phase with the medium but in the case of lyophobic some special methods are required that is chemical method, Briggs arc method and peptization method. So in this way we finish the preparation of collide in the next class in the next video we will be discussing the method of purification of colloidal solution. So thank you everyone.